So yeah, we're gonna do the ILS first. ILS first. ILS. And it's like we said, it's all set up. You got everything you need here. You got your distance. All we have to do is uh, activate the approach once we get given it. And there we go. Forty. Lift off. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, welcome to the sky. guys we hey. want to do some approaches denied yeah right I, I, honestly after last time i wouldn't put it past them but they remembered the call sign yeah, exactly. yeah. they have it written down oh, these these again. Again. if they call well see you in a bit zero mike alpha nah, i'll be gone no <laughs> <laughs> orlando departure skyhawk 670 mike alpha request 670 mike alpha orlando go ahead yeah, I just took off from the Orlando Executive Westbound. Uh, we'd like to request three approaches into Exec, ILS, Localizer, and uh, on a full stop. 3670 Mike Alpha, Clark 0331. 0331, Sir Mike Alpha. 2164 about well, leaving 10,000 spirit for uh, 6,000 with India at Executive Vector. Never hear Mike Alpha, radar contact 5 miles northwest of Executive Airport. Um, for the ILS runway 7, flighting 250, climb and maintain 2000. 250 on the heading and 2000. Zero, Mike Alpha. That's 25. 250, 2000, up we go. Cool. So he's going to give us vectors to final. Reach wave. Well, that'll work. So out. that's perfectly what we said. Exactly, yeah. exactly as we briefed it. So now it's all just about knowing situationally where we are. Like we got everything we need here. You know, Denmore's here. You got your distance from Denmore here, which is, as we're on this side, it's going to get lower and lower. But then once we go past it, it swing us back around towards the course. Right. Oh sh! You got the you got the thing. I bought that. Nice. Shit, bro, yeah, 188 bucks down. Yeah. Actually, they emailed me. So. Oh really? Yeah, they're. I had like 50 days left, and they're like, "Hey, we'll give you a free month." Oh, let's do it. I'm like one month. Wow. Uh, yeah, yeah. Thanks, guys. And of course, as as you are well, well aware, the ILS bottlenecks it gets more sensitive as you get closer. Right. So nice and small corrections when we're on the, on the course. Yeah, that's what screws me up the most. Right. I, I don't know. I, I want to see results. Yeah. Yes, six six straight six. away. Bang! Yeah. Yeah. Bravo Golf, just expedite defense yeah. through 3000. For 670 Mike Alpha, on your missed approach, maintain VFR conditions. Climb will be described by Orlando Executive Tower. I'll tell you what, considering that we're on a we're on a heading, we're on a vector, Yeah, I would start setting up for landing now, so doing the pre-landing checklist now, so it's out of the way and done. Okay. You know, just really early. So pre-landing, we're gonna go landing light hey, on. City turn riding three zero zero. And autopilot off, seatbelt on, make sure best power and feels on both, and then okay, flaps as, as required. Zero zero zero. Absolutely. So, so like we said, when, when it's one dot, when the, the glide slot's one dot above us, we're gonna start configuring about 1900, one notch of flaps, 10 degrees. Three zero Mike Alpha, turn left, heading one eight zero. Left one eight zero zero Mike Alpha. Gateway 650 traffic. Well, now it's going to all start to happen. Yeah. Here we go. Gateway <laughs> 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 650, you're going to be above the moon shortly. Contact will end at 124.8. But you can see here it's giving you uh, to Denmore, Denmore 7.3, so you know your distance is from Denmore. But of course, the final approach fix on an ILS is glide slope intercept. So once we've intercepted that glide slope, it intercepts it. Down we go. See you later. Right, so this is 7.2 miles yes. from Denmore. Denmore, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Looking good so far. Nice and precise with this. I like it. We don't want to be below it. Here, my says the tower closes on the hour. About 18 more minutes. So some of the approaches, the tower will be closed. All right, Roger. No problem. Thanks. I'm glad you heard me. Yeah, three, she's telling us they, they close on the hour. What time is it? Never mind. Here, my God. Turn left. Six forty one. Join the localizer. Uh, a left turn, join the localizers here, Mike Alpha. Contact so, good day. we'll do a hey, left turn here, wait, and then wait for this to come in. Exactly. So so kind of anticipate that. Orlando, 135.3. Alright. 135.3, so Foxtrot. Well, this is where it all starts to happen. Let approach 6.5, 6.3 for 6. I can't wait. So oh, that's swinging in. Yeah. There we go. Uh. There you go, kind of shallow it up a little bit, let it intercept. Yeah. Or let it come in and kind of anticipate that intercept and then turn to, to a heading. We, we spoke on the ground that there's going to be a wind from the right side. So. Right, right, right. Oh, sh. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, we. I might, have, I might have to kind of. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. There it goes. Still coming in, right? There's a trick to this as well. See, this is giving you a desired track of uh, 073. Yeah. If you match your track with 073 when you're on the localizer, when you're on it. 
when you're on it. Exactly, that's going to keep you on it. That's going to give you your wind correction. Uh, well, oh, I see. Well, because this is saying we, we are turned right more than exactly, that, so right? I see what you're exactly. saying. Exactly. So it's matched up, even though it's on eastbound. That's even Georgia more. Mike Alpha, you're five miles from Denmark. Cleared ILS runway seven approach. Cleared the ILS runway seven approach. You're on Mike Alpha. Perfect. I don't have to repeat back no. seven miles. Nope. That's exactly. And that's what a lot of people get confused about. Like, uh, seven miles. It's whatever. Yeah, he's right. Just, he's just telling you that's where you are, and you cleared for the approach. Just giving us a little Six awareness. Five, exactly. You guys are just on a vector exactly. intercept or no? So what I would do is... Uh, I'm sorry, say again for 645. This is off a little bit from this, so that's going to be a little bit confusing. Uh, I forget it. Okay, yeah, so that's like... <laughs> yeah, perfect. How about there? So now you can bug your head in. You can see you're holding a little bit left of course here. If we were on the on the localizer perfectly, that, this heading would be perfect. So let's just get back on it. Yeah, okay. Okay, so I'm going to wait. Yep, exactly. Hold it, let it come to you, and then anticipate, because the ILS is very, very uh, sensitive. Then you can roll it back around to a heading. You can kind of match up the track with the des uh, desired track. Whatever that heading gives you, bug that heading, hold the heading, see you later. Nice, small corrections, perfect. Because we're, well, we are pretty close now too, so. We are, we are. So we're coming up to Denmore. So yeah, 2000, then we'll get the glide slope exactly. at Denmore. And Absolutely. then we'll lower it down to 1020 and. Uh, well, on the glide slope, if you maintain the glide slope, you're going to hit 1020 anyway. So you don't need to worry about 1020. Ah. You just follow the glide slope. Okay, okay. okay. That 1020 is for the localizer only. Okay. Uh, so the, the only only thing we're worried about after that, Report after Denmore, after the glide slope intercept, right is uh, three, five, maintaining glide slope, maintaining the localizer uh, at the minimum, which is 391. Heading at 355, 250. Okay. Delta. Nice small correction, bringing it back in. I like it. Uh, you're getting it back and you swing it back around 073 on the track. Kind of set a heading. November 6766, Foxtrot Radar, contact 30 miles west. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. There we go, baby. Such a small correction, but it did a lot of work for I you. I know, right? Beautiful. It's like in your head, you're like having to do so much. Absolutely. So you can see we're one dot low on this. So you can start pulling the power back a little bit. About, you said about 1800 or so. 1900 or so. Maintain altitude. We're already below uh, the uh, 110, so you get one notch flaps in there. As we come in, you can see we're intercepting it, so then you can start that descent and follow the glide slope now, so you can get it to like 80, uh, 90 to 100 knots. Uh, so, yeah, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I gotta lower it. There you go. Absolutely. There you go. So now we're above the glide slope, you're just re-intercepting it and holding the crosshairs. Yeah. So if you look, 1900, it's got you between 90 and 100 knots. Perfect there, yeah. Pitching for glide slope and kind of hold the, the RPMs there. Okay, so... Perfect. So a little bit high, so bring that descent rate down just a little bit more so we can re-intercept. Okay, so like 700 right there. Yeah, exactly. In. That'll work, so it's coming back in a little bit. Just yeah. hold it, keep, keep the nose down a little bit. Ah, uh, yep, 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 yep. Really get it back in. If you needed to in this situation, because it's a little bit high, if you needed to pull power, you can do. Number 67665, okay. reset your transponder squawk 1031. There you go, now it's coming back in. A little bit right of course, so just yeah, starting off. to swing it over. Because we've got so many things going on, right? you got so many, know, so many different so things. Much I know. Okay, so yeah. Nice and slow corrections. I'm liking how small these corrections are. Really liking it. So now we're back on glide slope, so now you can get it. We're already at 1900 RPM. You can kind of try and get that speed back to uh, 90 to 100 knots. Bam! Baby f***ing bullseye! The boy got it back. I got it back. Boy, got it back. I got it back. No, just hold it. You're yeah, up. You're yeah. up. 100 knots. You're still within the uh, the 9200 knots. So you're fine. Looking good. Going above it now. And kind of raise the nose just a little bit. Oh, raise it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Just arrested. Exactly. That's it. Not let go up. So now you're back on this, and you're back within the 9200 knots. You're looking beautiful, man. So let me arrest the descent rate a little bit more there. There you go. Number five six six. Turn right. Beautiful, speed's fine. He's got the crosshairs again. A minimum 391 or 400. Right, we gotta wait for that. Oh no. Right, a little bit off. Just take a quick look up and see how far off we are from the runway. Oh, yeah, there we go. That, that corresponds to that amount of deflection, which isn't really in the grand scheme of things. It doesn't look that much, yeah. But it, it takes you off. It really does. So. But you got really nice small corrections, and you're bringing me back onto the center line. Zero Mike Alpha, exact tower at there 8. we go. 8. 7. 18 seven zero Mike Alpha, thanks. 
Exec Tower, Cessna 670 Mike Alpha with you on the ILS runway 7. Number 0 Mike Alpha, number 1, runway 7, clear, touch and go. After your touch and go, uh, turn left northbound. Uh, clear, touch and go, runway 7, uh, after we'll turn uh, northbound, 0 Mike Alpha. And 0 Mike Alpha, just to confirm you're coming back in here, going to a different airport. We'll be coming back to see you, 0 Mike Alpha. Roger, just left northbound for now, and I'll uh, well, well. turn for you shortly. Roger. Yeah, thank you. Right, so nice. I need to go down here. I need to go down. We're we're off, so we need to bring it back Number right. Four, nice and slow Lake Lake corrections. Yeah, well, that, that, that distraction f***ed everything up. That really did. And that's what's going to happen. Uh, whatever you need. Four to kill. That's exactly what's going to happen. Four so we're at 400 feet and go missed. Two, following uh, stuff the traffic, two miles Full power. Uh, uh, climb it up. And wait till I get positive here. Exactly. And positive rate. Number two, clear land. You're up. You're up. Good, good, good. Zero Mike Alpha missed. No, zero Mike Alpha, Roger. Ay, ay, ay. Just right. like, uh, damn. Northbound we go. Uh, All right. Suspended. Yeah, for the bad. most part, that was really nice. It's just that last little where it gets really bottlenecked and then yeah, every, we'll, everything started to happen at once. It's yeah. It lost a little bit of focus. Well, that's going to happen, man. Okay. It was a really late, it's, uh, really late. <laughs> Great. I'll just blame it on that. Yeah. So, all the Cessna. Blame the Cessna. <laughs>